Jim, Excel Logistics. Can you just introduce the company to me and, and what they do? Okay, so Excel Logistics is the leading contract uh, logistics provider in North America. We have over 500 sites between the US and Canada. We're a division of the DHL supply chain, which is part of DHL Corporation. Obviously, DHL is the leading provider of transportation and logistics services and is one of the 10 largest companies worldwide with over 480,000 employees. In our site in McAllen, we have over 150 employees and we process over 1,000 orders a day, 3,000 lines, 200,000 pieces on one shift. Wow, that's some pretty impressive statistics. What mobile computer do you use today to do that operation? So the site's been in existence since 2002. For the last 12 years, we've used the MC90 family and has been the primary handheld computer for all of our wireless transactions. So you've just started to introduce TC8000 as part of our beta program. What have your users seen as a difference and a benefit by going to that new form factor? So, so we've deployed the gun into our picking area for the last 12 weeks, and we work closely with our IT development team and our users to uh, enhance the product in terms of the input and the, f and the inputs to the screen. Uh, when using the TC8000, we've seen four primary advantages. The first is the heads-up display, where our operators do not have to tilt, the, tilt their wrist to validate the, the, the accuracy of a scan. So that, that provides great efficiency in the operation. The other thing that our operators have highlighted is the light weight of the product. The product is very easy to hold, reduces their fatigue you know, for the, throughout the whole day, especially on the days when we have extended shifts and working overtime. Um, another feature that they like is the way the, the hand, hand strap cradles the gun to their hand. They're actually able to use their fingers in almost a hands-free fashion while still holding the device and grabbing a case of product. The last feature that I think it's one of the most important is the ease of use. The people that we hire new have never used a handheld terminal before, but they've all used an Android-based cell phone. So not only do they have familiar familiarity with the touchscreen display, but our, our application developer has gone into that display and has, has figured out a way how to eliminate keystrokes compared to the old green screens where you needed two fingers to tab and input a, a key on a keypad. So now with the touch screen display, and a good example of this is a prompt for lithium ion battery. Does this shipment contain a lithium ion battery? Before we had to hit the tab and index to the right field, and now we just are prompt the operator, is it a lithium ion battery uh, shipment? Yes or no, and they can hit a yes or a no, and then continue with the transaction. So you're saying that your users aren't missing the 52 keys on MC9000 at all? No, I think the users, the, and, and another telling factor, we put the user, the gun in a few people's hands, and what I would call the, um, the old school folks were actually pleased with the operation, the people that are very uh, slow to adapt to change, and then when we put it into the hands of the quick adapters, uh, they didn't want to go back. And we're going to hear from a few of our, our key adapters uh, shortly. We're going to talk to the IT people that help make this a reality. And we're going to go directly to two people that have used the gun for the last 12 months to get their opinion. Let's go and play that video now. So this project started almost two years ago. I came into the office one day, there was a box on my desk. I opened it up, powered on the device, and saw it was Android. It brings us into that modern age. Um, the users down on the floor that use it, it reminds them of their cell phone. And one of the beauties of it was it's so easy to work with. Um, I've never worked with an Android device on an enterprise product before, and it, it was really surprising how easy it was to set it up, get it configured, and get it deployed. We're here, Elvia, Elizabeth, thank you so much for taking time with us today to talk about 
your experience with the TC-8000. Um, I bet when they asked you to pilot this TC-8000, you didn't think that you would end up sitting in front of a camera at the end of the time. No, no, definitely not. not. No. So we appreciate that very much. So, uh, can you give us an idea, uh, each of you, how long you uh, worked in the warehouse operations? Oh, um, I've been working here for seven years. Seven years? Yeah, seven years. And Elizabeth? I've also been seven years. I think we were about so. maybe a couple of months. What was your impression of the TC-8000 when they first gave it to you to work on the warehouse floor? For me, I was very impressed. I remember that day when they brought me the, the gun and the device and gave it to me and I tried it on and I said, oh God, I like it. <laughs> I like it because the reason that when I put it on, it just felt like it was um, part of my hand. I mean, it was just perfect for my hand. I love it. The first time that they brought it out, I thought the screen was really, really cool. I mean, the fact that we, we don't have this massive uh, gun, plus you have the handle on the bottom. Uh, everything is just like whenever you're on your phone, you use your, your fingers for everything nowadays, you know? So it was, to me, it was it was real easy to get, uh, to adapt to. Uh, the way you were holding it was uh, less pressure on my wrist. It wasn't as heavy. I, I really, I really liked it when I first got it. Each of you, what would you say is your favorite thing? Do you have one favorite thing you can say about it? Oh, the scanning and the serial numbers. It's so much faster. It, it captures the serial numbers very quickly. Uh, I can probably go uh, through a box of 250 serial numbers in less than three minutes. I mean, it, and uh, that makes my life a lot easier in that way. We designed the TC-8000 to make your life easier uh, and to make you more efficient. Do you think we've achieved that goal? Oh, definitely, I think so. I would, I would totally give you Tens all around. Yeah, Tens. Definitely, yes. You know, one thing that I really love, Elizabeth, I don't know about you, but um, the touch screen. Oh, you yes. Know, it's just, it's, I like it. Well, with, now, with the technology nowadays, yeah. I mean, you have your phone and everything now, all the phones that you have is always, you know, I feel like I'm texting, seriously. What are other aspects? Uh, battery life is an example. Um, oh, the battery life is amazing. Yes. Um, I'd have, I got a, a battery from Mike, I believe it was Tuesday. And uh, it, I still have at least half of that, you know, so it, it, and I know that it would probably last me until maybe next week. And Elizabeth, I had mine for like three days already, so, and it's still going, so <laughs> at three days, uh, we usually work like between 10 hours, or yeah. yeah. sometimes 12 hours a yeah. day. Very good. How about comparing the TC-8000 to the MC-9000 in, in ergonomics, is it easier to hold? Is it easier to use over the course of a, a 12 hour workday? This, it's amazing the fact that it's just, it's just like if you're riding a bike, you know what I mean? It's, it's just perfect for how your hand is supposed to be. I also, there's something that I really like is the, the camera, you know, because I can take pictures and then somebody else can see those pictures. Like for example, if I have a damaged material in my area, I can take the picture and then send it to my supervisor and say, oh, this is what I found. I found this damaged material. So I think that's a pretty cool um, thing to have, the camera. If you were asked to use the TC-8000 or the MC-9000, would you go back to the MC-9000? Or would you want to stay with the TC-8000? I would want to stay with it. Definitely. I'll stay with the TC-8000. <laughs> Excellent answer. Very good. Great examples there of um, your users loving the product. I think it's the only way to describe it there. Productivity, are you already starting to see some productivity gains uh, with the TC-8000? So during this trial, not only were we trying to improve the input screens, but we we're also taking time studies and measurements of our people during the scanning process. Depending on the product being scanned, if it was a serial number capture required for warranty entitlement or not, we were seeing between 10 to 20 percent improvements in productivity so in that 20 process. 20 percent productivity improvement. We, we were seeing some very good improvements in productivity. Not only improve in, in, in productivity, but also accuracy of scanning. And that accuracy, um, what does that mean to you in a warehouse? How important is that accuracy? So, so from a business standpoint, we. It is very critical for us to not only retain customers and bring new customers on board, some of our contractual equipment, uh, commitments require that we reduce our cost. So part of the DHL culture is continuous improvement, 
we have the first choice way continuous improvement process, but we need to continue to use devices like the TC8000 to drive cost out of our operation and be able to improve the value proposition for all our customers. And the TC8000, is that now part of your longer term journey? Are you looking at other features on the product that you didn't have before that are going to enable that productivity? Uh, there are some additional advanced features that we haven't uh, implemented yet, but there is the multi-scanning that allows us to scan uh, multiple barcodes at the same time. And again, this goes back to the need to capture serial numbers. And when we do that, imagine when getting down from one scan instead of 10 scans for every case. Uh, we measure productivity in milliseconds, and in each one of these changes that the device bring, the change of tilting a hand and reading the display, the change of a couple keystrokes with your fingers, the, the time it takes to put down the device and pick it up versus not having to put it down, all those and the reduction in fatigue for our people is what's going to drive what drives that total productivity that I mentioned. Brilliant.